Hi guys and welcome. Um, this is a bit of a special this one. What we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to be talking about affiliate marketing and you'll see someone sitting by the side of me on my left hand side. This is Samuel, my youngest son. So Sam, say hello. Hello. Um, now obviously we are recorded so we're not going to get any feedback back but what we are going to do is I thought this would be really good. This would be a good way of showing other people um, what affiliate marketing is all about, especially if there's any newbies out there that have been sitting on the side and they just got no idea what affiliate marketing is, because uh, you can categorically say you don't know what affiliate marketing is. No, can you? <laughs> so Sam, in the moment, he's been doing work experience with me, and he's very lucky because not only does he learn a bit of plumbing and heating, uh, but also. Um, he learns a bit of my other side of my business as well, which is affiliate marketing. So Sam gets to have both sides of the bread buttered, if you like. Um, so he's quite lucky on that side of it. So Sam, uh, what have you been doing today so far with my business? Um, so we did, um, we, we with our plumbing and heating engineering, yeah. we um, had to, so you know those like sensor things uh, in the bar, I can't remember what they're called. Oh, uh, yeah. that's right. Yeah, it was the thermo Yeah, we had a, a belching thermostatic bath mixer yeah. shower, which had jammed on, so it was spouting out boiling hot water, and this yeah. poor woman couldn't shower, and also, more importantly, um, she could have been scolded, couldn't she? Yeah. So that was one of our emergencies that we went out to, uh, and we obviously made safe, and we're waiting for the lady to get the parts, and then we're going to fit that back tomorrow, aren't we? Okay, yeah. Uh, and what was the other one that we did? Um... Well, there was another one where we had to fit. We had to tighten this um, valve because it, um, it, it it was like leaking water. That's right. Uh, that is actually not leaking water. That was leaking oil, and oh. that was an oil line going to an oil boiler. And because of the cost of oil now is quite expensive, a lot of people, if they get an oil leak, that you should anyway. You should never leave uh, an oil leak unintended, especially when it's hot, mm. because the oil can vaporize and it can explode. Yeah. Oil was dense, so if you threw a match on it, effectively it wouldn't light, yeah. although I wouldn't expect anyone to do that. But if it evaporates, then evaporated oil is more dangerous because it will ignite. That's why with oil boilers, we vaporise oil by atomising it. Yeah. Uh, and we use special nozzles uh, that are set at 140 psi, and then it's ignited by electri electric, so, okay, And that's what ignites it, and that's obviously what heats it up. Now... After we've talked about that, the next stage, what we're going to be doing is we were talking to mum, weren't we? And mum's actually in the process of doing an angelic course. Yeah. So what we thought we would do is we are going to actually create uh, a website. We're just going to create a website. So what we thought this would be really cool. Not only is this a training tutorial for people that are inside Limitless, but also... I have my son here that's learning this as well, okay? So this is going to be really cool. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to shrink the screen down and me and Sam are going to start to build this website. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to jump over. So this is where eventually I'm going to be posting up this video. You can see I've got 300 members here, Sam. So I've got quite a few people. So I'm just going to move my my video back. Now Sam is still sitting to this, by the side of me, so he's going to be learning. So you can always uh, perch him when you need to, Sam. Okay, yeah. so as I said to you, this is live. So the first thing we're going to do now is we're going to jump over to Builderall. Now, I use Builderall because it's really, really quick and easy. And Builderall has Cheetah Website Builder, okay, which is effectively a very good website builder. So we're going to click on here as enter. Now, what I could do is I could cheat, and I've already got a website that I've already built. But for this uh, training tutorial, um, we're going to do it from scratch. Okay. okay, so I'm just going to wait for this video here to boot up. Okay, and what we're going to do is we're going to click on Create Site. Now, normally what would happen is once you built the website, you'd then put it into a domain, and we'd go out, because my, my wife's name is Chrissy, we'd probably put like Chrissy's Angelic um, Healing, something like that, something that's quite catchy that we would use that is going to help uh, obviously promote what my wife is trying to do with holistic uh, ways of healing, etc., using angelistic energy, where we use crystals, and basically the energy comes through the crystal, and then it helps to heal people that have issues and stuff like that. So that's how that works. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to click on Professional Template, and we're going to search through the templates to see if we can find a website that is almost pre-built, and then we're going to put the other bits and bobs on it to make it look what we want, okay? 
So we're going to scroll through. So basically, if you looked on the side here, I'm just going to move my face up here. You'll see that we've got blank, new, niche funnels, business funnel pages. So this might be a good one. Let's check here. And what we want really is is something which is well-being. Do you know what well-being is, Sam? Um, sorry, does it like in, does it involve like uh, a lot of communities? It does to a certain degree. Yeah, well-being is all about helping your inner self. It's also helping about you know you, you're helping yourself to be better, to be happier. Well-being is spiritual. It can be spiritual-minded, or it could be you know you could be um, it's it's having uh, grounding. So, you know, there's a lot of things that it could be, actually. Uh, well-being covers a lot of things. Meditation, yoga, eating properly, you know, having a healthier life, having a healthier mind, creating a better mindset. You know, so there's a lot of things that, that you can use for that. Okay, so we're looking through here. So we could try a fitness funnel. These sometimes are quite good. So let's have a look at this one. And you'll see there's all sorts of different colours here. And we can go for a pink theme. You see that we're spoiled on what we can actually use here, okay? So we've just got to look for something. Let's have a look at the influencers page. And you can see there's lots and lots of pages here which I can choose, okay? Uh, food and drink. What I can also do, because I'm very, very lucky enough to be a funnel, uh, I, I, I actually um, have funnel builder as well. So we can go here, and if I go across here, I can actually choose a funnel. So if I come across here, I can actually make myself my own website funnel. So if we go along here, click on here, and you'll see that you're getting a bit overwhelmed with what you can see here, are you, Sam? There's just so much stuff here, isn't it? You don't believe. Oh, here we go, funnel clubs. You don't so know what click... to go for, do you? That's correct, yeah. So we want to find the right one. And if we can't quite find the right one, then we can actually make one anyway, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to the Funnel Builder and we're going to see if there's any new ones that have just hit the market. Congratulations. Just click on that. So we're going to come across here. So Funnels of the Month. So there's a couple of here which we might be able to use. So these are Builder Role, Website Chatbot, Launch Manager, Quiz Builder. And then if we carry on going through, you'll see that these are quite good. So we've got Builder Role Premium Funnels, Niche Funnels lead capture funnels, agency funnels, info product funnels, physical product funnels, chatbot funnels, cheetah funnel builder, viral funnels. So these are funnels that are already doing really, really well. Sales page funnels. Let's have a look at these ones. Let's go to sales page. And we're just going to open this up and have a look. So it's just going to take a while because where I'm filming, it's obviously slowing it down just a fraction. Okay. And you can see that we get lots of stuff that come up here, okay? So let's go for physical product. Let's try this one. It's just giving you an idea of how we can create a website, Sam. Yeah. Here we go. So this one looks cool. Let's go for this one. Or this one here, okay? So this one's discover a new secret. That's that's a weight loss, okay? But it doesn't matter because I can I can change it about a bit for it to be angelistic. So let's try this one, okay? So let's try the green. So let's go for this. So I'm going to click on download this funnel, and what it's going to do is because I'm already in the funnel club, it's just going to upload it inside my cheetah. Yeah. As you can see, look, hello Darren Brown. Confirm the date to finish the action. So it's a slimming tea. It's from final builder roll to Darren Brown at hotmail.co.uk. That's why it's very important for people who are in Builder Role. Um, if there's any of these funnels that you want, just let me know and just give me your email address and I will send it straight across to your account if you're already um, my um, member. Okay, if you're already a member with inside my Builder Role. So we're going to click on Confirm. And what it's going to do now, Sam, is it's going to open up inside the Cheer Builder and we're going to use this to start with. So we're going to go to go to site dashboard. So do you use it as a template then? That's it. That's correct. Now, when you ever, whenever you send a website, 
it's always unpublished okay so you'll see it's always unpublished and the reason why is because we can set this up so now what we're going to do is we click on here go to settings and then we're going to change this now to Chris's um, angelic healing and we're going to change this so if I copy this white mouse click copy and I'm just going to paste that in there control V or control C to copy control V to paste I've got to do the same with this as well now you notice that it's coming up with a few errors that's because it's a URL you're not allowed spaces so all you need to do is make sure that you put a dash and then it will clear it all up okay so that's that and then what we're going to do now is we need to get a picture of something okay so we're going to create a picture to go into this so we've got Chris's angelic healing now what we're going to do is we're going to go over to Canva. Canva is completely free, by the way, Sam. So if you want to start doing this on your computer later on, you can. Uh, and we can open up Canva, which we're doing right here. And all we're going to do is we're going to look for uh, a picture, which we're going to put for the website. So then when anyone clicks on it, the picture will come up here. All right. And it just looks a bit more professional. So we're going to go and choose one. So we'll use this one. I've already used this before. I'm going to open this page up and then we're just going to take this out, take this out, take this out, and take this out. Okay, so what we need to do really is we need to find a picture for, of mum, but we can't do that just yet. So, how we're going to overcome that is we are going to leave the picture until later. Okay, but what we will do is if we use the tools that are available for us for completely free, first one which you can use is Google, or you can just in the browser, we can put angelic healing. So you could get a picture of like a crystal and put it as a background. That's it. That's what we're going to do, yeah. Sam. So what I've got is angelic healing is here. Okay, it's angelic healing crystals here. So we're just going to open this up and then I'm going to click on, let's move this back down here. I'm going to click on this bit here which is called images and then what I'm doing now is I'm searching with inside images and I'm going to find a picture which we can start using okay so there's loads and loads of great pictures there right so what one do you think mum would really like? I think the second one looks good oh, mom. what about that one there that looks cool which one? maybe the second one point to it uh, that one there this one here? yeah so we're going to use this one here right? yeah okay so we're, what we're going to do then is I'm now going to use a tool which is really, really good. It's called Snipping Tool. I don't know if you ever use this, Sam. If you use Windows? Um, yeah, sometimes if I want to shrink an well, image, I use Snipping Tool. Yeah. Snipping Tool is built inside Windows. It's really helpful. Yeah, so what we need to do is click on here and then click on New. And then we're just going to grab this picture like so. Like that. And then we're going to hit Save As. I'm just going to put Chrissy one okay and what we're going to do is we're going to head over to our builder roll back to our canva where we're working and we're going to paste this picture in there okay so we're going to go to uploads upload media and what we're doing now is we're just taking off the picture that's on my computer and put it into canva okay which is this picture here so we're going to click on this link here and open and now this picture is going, as soon as I click on it, or it may just jump across, okay? So we're just going to bring that across like so. And what you can do with these sometimes, is if I just delete it, if I hold on to that and drag it across, if I hold it to the corner, it actually goes across the whole of the picture already. So Taking now, time, isn't it? yeah, so we've now got that whole picture. So now the next thing we're going to do is we are going to put in some just a little bit of text okay now I was going to use the pink text that looks quite cool so if we click on here use certain fonts can't you yep I'm going to use glow this works quite well and we're just going to put that exact color works well Chris's yeah, it stands out doesn't it and that's yeah. exactly what we want it's a bit like a crystal glowing yeah so Chris's angelic Healing. I'll have to spell that wrong. Like that, right? And then we could either, I'm going to shrink it down a bit, bring it out like that. 
I think that will look better like that, okay? So we can play around. And then what I was going to do, I was gonna, do you think we should get a crystal here? Something, some crystals? Uh, yeah, may, maybe you could. Yeah? You could put a little bit of text saying like what it's about in like a certain colour. Oh, we're going to do all that on the website later, okay? So let's put angelic crystals. We'll see if we bring up any crystals. Okay, so we've got some crystals here. Now, the problem is, is you see the black background? That's going to look a little bit a little bit dodgy, right? But I'm going to show you a little trick that we can do. So we're going to use... Well, what we can do is we're going to grab these pictures, which I've just shown you how to do this. So the first one we're going to do is we're going to grab this picture here. So I'm just going to show you how we do this. I'm going to show you some wizardry of my own. So we're going to save that. So I'm going to put Chrissy 2. And we're going to grab this one. This one's Chrissy 2. Oh! Now, the reason it's done that, Sam, is because I've already pointed it down. So I've just got to put three into yeah. the two, okay? And then we're going to... I can't really grab that as much as i like to, but we're going to grab this one here. Now, I'm going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a special program in a minute, and we're going to take the background out. I'm going to show you how we're going to do that as well. Now, there's lots to learn in affiliate marketing. This is literally, you know, just such a tiny smidget of what you're learning now. But these are life skills that are going to help you. Okay, so we've done that. So we've got that. We've got that. I want this one here. I wanted to get as well. Okay. So I know Chrissy will like that one. What you could do is you could put it in like corners of the homepage. That's exactly what, what I'm going to do. But we're going to use it in our picture. What kind of information are you going to put on there though? Are you going to say like yeah. how the how like what, what what the course offers and stuff like that yeah eventually we're going to be doing stuff like that but we're going to get the basis done and then we're going to show you know which you can obviously follow so the first one next thing we do is we're going to move to another tab in our browser and we're going to type in remove background okay now the idea of this is we just want to bring up this one here which is called remove background image remove bg right we're going to click on this this is going to open up. Now this is what I use, completely free Sam, don't cost me anything. And what I do is I just click on upload image. I grab the image which I've already grabbed. So we're going to do this one first. Open. And it's going to take out all of the background. And then we're just going to download that. That's that one done. Right, then we're going to grab another image. We've got four, haven't we, in total. So you see how quick, if you've got the certain tools, how quick we can do things. So I'm going to open this. This is another one. Can you see like it's taking the background out? Yeah. Download. That's another one. I'm going to move across to the next one. Sometimes it's not what you know, it's who you know or who's taught you or who's mentored you or where you've learned from in the first place. Which makes all the difference. Right, so we've done this one, we've done this one, we've just got this one here. Open. See, it's taken all of the background out again download that and then we're going to grab another one which is the last one this one I think it's going to struggle with because there's a lot of info on it but we'll try it anyway let's see what it does we can still use that okay because what I'm going to do I'm going to put that in the corner yeah yeah so what we're going to do now is we'll go back to Canva and now we're going to upload these pictures we're going to go back to upload upload media and we're going to go to quick access because that's where it's going to be. So I don't know if you know about Windows, but whenever you do a, a like a if it's a picture or a photo, quick access will remember it. So what we can do now is these are, if you notice all these pictures that have come down, these aren't the ones that have got the background. So you need to do is go to do download because that's where it will actually download itself. We hold the control key down. We can download all four of these at the same time. And you see, like it's uploading it into there like that. And now, what we can do is we can put these into place. 
So we got this one. Let's click on that. And we put this one like that. That one there. What should we do for that one there? Like that. The one in the middle. Now we can make this bigger or, or smaller. Like that. And then we could move this over. And then we're going to put that arrow. Yeah, that looks good. Like that. Okay. So that's what we've got. That's a start, isn't it? Right, so then we're going to save it. So we call it Chris's 12. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go back over here. And we're going to add this into what we've been building. Which, if I can find it. Here we go. This is Chris's angelic healing, right? So let's just change that up a bit. So we'll just scroll down and it says add a favour con. So the first thing we're going to do is going to add a favour. What a favour con is, I don't know if anyone knows. Same as I'll tell you anyway. But if you look at the if you look at the top here, you'll see that sometimes you get like a graphic at the top. See that, Sam? Yeah. And when you put a favour con in, it comes up at the top. So you can see, look, no one's bothered with that one. No one's bothered with that one. But as soon as I put the favour con in, which I've got to upload... So I'm just going to upload this now. Go to quick access. I think the pink one would look really good. Yeah. That's interesting. These, these are nice, easily registered. Let's just cancel this a minute. Don't look like that's downloaded. Let's go back here. Right, so Chrissy12, we're going to share download we're going to download it in the ping it's because i downloaded it and we're going to download it in a jpeg now a ping is quite a long uh, i don't know if you know about pings and jpegs well what a jpeg is is a shrinked it's almost like it's uh been wind zipped okay it, it it's less memory so we're going to download both anyway you find that you lose a little bit of the clearness when you jpeg something and then we're going to go back into here there's lots to learn in SM. Um, yep. I'm going to click select file and now we're going to grab that picture. So I'm going to use the ping one because it's just going to be a little bit more crystal clear. Click on that and then save. Okay, so that's our favour con done. Okay, now we're going to save that. And what it should do is it should come up here in the corner every time someone clicks on that right so the next thing we're going to do now is we're going to go into the home page the pending page and the thank you page now the idea of this is you have a home page which is almost like this is what captures the email and then you have a pending page that after they've captured the email they have to confirm that they're happy for the person that's buying something or ordering something or is scheduling a um, call with Chrissy right your yeah. mum that is pending so after you do that you have to make sure that you confirm that they're happy to let you have the email and then you get a reward now what the reward might be is that Chrissy may have made uh, like a, an ebook to do with angelic healing and he might have 12 different things to do to, which is going to help heal you before you've even gone to a practitioner so you know and you're going to get that free and that's what's going to encourage people to want to put their email in to click that they're waiting for their gift and then when they click to confirm that they're happy with the email they then get the ebook okay and that's how that's how affiliate marketing works Sam. that's how one part of affiliate marketing works anyway okay so we, it's impossible for me to keep doing this for a very long time because your time spans going as we speak isn't it but saying that we can still edit the home page okay so i'm just going to show you how we're going to do this okay there's loads of ways to do this but we're going to click on here edit page and we're going to open up this page and what we're going to do is we're going to have a little play with this and see what we can do but you see how easy it is with build a roll very very quick so discover the new secret that celebrities are using to lose weight so we can put here is discover and 
And we're going to put Chrissy's angelic healing methods. You might want to put it in caps. I'm going to. Yeah. Uh, let's put help with well-being. Okay, remember I was talking to you about what well-being is. Well-being, yeah. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to jazz it up a bit. So you were on about caps this. So let's caps that. So let's just do it this way. And we're going to caps that as well. Yeah. Gonna caps this. Healing methods. Now what I was gonna do actually, I was gonna change this to a different colour, right? So discover Chrissy's angelic healing. So let's make that pink. And what you do, Sam, is you highlight this, alright, and then move over to here, and this is the text colour. And then if you haven't got a colour that you want, what you do is you click on more colours. And then you scroll down to what colour you want. This one to be a good colour. This one or this one, right? So uh, light pink will probably work better. So we go there and now click OK. And then and that should. There we go. Chris's angelic healing. So we discover Chris's angelic healing. So the idea of that, what we've done is we've made the picture come out a bit. Now there's a few things I need to do here. You can see the formatting is jumping all over the place. So we're just gonna change this up a bit. So you could either scroll this down. Or we can move this out or we can even change the size so if we click on here you click on it until it and then drag it across and then we go to size we're just going to scroll down to 38 that just bring it down a bit that makes it look a bit near doesn't it discover chris's angelic healing methods to help with well-being okay now a miraculous tea so this is uh Just going to move this across like so. So what we're going to do now is we're going to try and put in a capture. So we want to hook something that's going to make them want to be interested. So a miraculous, miraculous is quite a good word, isn't it? But we could put a miraculous method with no invasive. Have I spelled that right? Invasive. Invasive. You could Google it. I could. Um, approach to helping your body and mind with crystals using angelic energy okay to make it look professional you could put like a comma where it says after my like after mind your body and mind with crystal using angelic so we want a comma there yeah yeah, you could just yeah, you could have put it like that. Yeah, cool. And then what we do is um, we'll make this pink as well. The reason why we're doing this, we're making it stand out. So if I click on here again, highlight the keywords, more color. I'm going to go to this one again, and then click OK. Okay, using angelic energy. Now, really, this should be an A, you know, this A should be capital. Because if you notice, if you change everything to capital, it makes it stand out. Makes you want to read more, doesn't it? Yeah. Body. Miraculous method with no invasive approach to helping your body and mind with crystals using angelic energy, right? So it's a shame we haven't got a picture of mum because we could put mum's picture <laughs> in it. So we're going to delete that for now, okay? And then what we could do is we'll put a, 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 well, we'll work that out in a minute. So fill out the form below and take the first step to access course. So access, access a higher 
energy and well being. That sounds good. Ebook. Here. And you could put an exclamation mark. Yep, sounds good. I like that. Okay, so we've done that. And then what we need to do now is just change this. So when you change this, all you need to do is click on here, which is edit element, and it will bring up my floating element. If you don't want a floating element, just get rid of it. Open this up. Now click on this. Then click on this. And then it gives you this, which is not a floating element anymore. We can click on headline. And I'm going to put, yes, I would love this. Okay. And we could change this to a pink, can we? Yeah. So let's go general color. So we're going to click on here. Now it won't be the hover pink, it will only be this. So we would, what we do is we'll try and find that color. Now there is a way to get that color, right? Um, you, there's a tool that you can use, which is normally built into this truck called Color Dropper. And you can download it using the Chrome, okay? But for now, I'm just going to show you this, all right? Because I don't want to go too in depth. So we've done that. Now we're going to just move this across. And I feel that looks really cool, don't you? Discover Chris's angelic healing methods to help with well being, a miraculous method with no invasive approach to helping your body and mind with crystals using angelic energy. Okay, so that will do. All right, so what you do, always never forget this, Sam always save right so we're going to save this it's going to bring up a file we're going to say yes go to website so you can preview it now that's it and then that's done and then what we would do is we would connect this up now to connect this up with um, actual making sure that the email works what you'd have to do is you go back into here, okay, which is the main dashboard of Builder Roll. And what we want to do is we want to move across and we're looking for um, it's called Mailing Boss. It's normally on number one. That's where I have it. And then we're going to click on Enter. And what we're going to do is we're going to set this up now. This is the email. Now you've probably never seen anything like this in your life, Sam, okay? Now you can use a workflow. But I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new list. So I'm going to click on list. And then I'm going to create a new list. Okay, so we're going to click on here. And then I'm going to put the list names. We're going to call it Chris's, if I can spell. Chris's uh, Angelic Healing List. Okay, description. Angelic healing people and helping well-being. Now the only reason you do this, right, is you don't want to be pulled up for spam. So the idea is if you put something like this and then you could just put, uh, the idea you put a tag is you can actually put a tag with inside something and if someone says something, it will automatically send it out. So you could put angelic healing or oh, I tell you what, we'll put angelic ebook because we haven't created an ebook yet, but I'm going to do that another day. And then a name is going to be Chris's. I'm wait a quick way to do this. Just copy that. Paste that in there like that. Okay, so we've done that. Now hit next. We've got double opt in out, double opt in in. What that means is it takes two events to actually come out of a subscription and two events to be inside a subscription, okay, Sam? And then we've got create email field, which basically this is where they will put their email in. And I always like to get their first name. I think it's quite personal to do that. And then you'll see that eventually you click save changes. And then you'll see here that it's important. So this is done. Chris's angelic healing is all complete, right? Nice. So we've got two fields. So now, when we go back to here, close, now we can add this email in. So if we click on here, click on this link, and we'll be add this list. We'll be able to add this list in now. 
Oh, hang on, let's click set list. Here we go. It's because we're filming, it's gone slow, Sam, all right? So yeah. you see, see, look, Chris's angelic healing list. And now we're going to hit save. Now, what will happen is anyone who puts an email in here, uh, we're going to put subscribe pending. And then eventually we'll open up our page. And our page is we want pending. And then select. So what will happen is that now, when anyone puts in their email list, it's going to take them to the subscribe pending page. This is when you're going to say, which we're going to do. I'm going to show you how you do this, right? So we'll click on here. So we've done that bit. Right, we save this. Always save, Sam. So if you're ever doing any work, whether it's on Builder or WordPress, always make sure that you save, okay? So yeah, we've done that. Save. Good. Okay, so we're not going to go there yet. What we're going to do now is we're going to go back to here. We're going to click on the pending page. And we're going to edit this pending page. And then if you can see here, it says, Attention, please confirm your email before continuing. All right. So let's just get rid of this picture. In fact, what we do is let's change this picture for something else. Just temporary, all right? Because we haven't got a picture of mum yet. But we can do this, right? So if we go select picture, I was going to use a, we'll use this one. Open. Click on there. Save. And you can see how powerful it is, right? Incredible, isn't it? It's so quick. How long does it take me just to send that picture across? This offer is exclusively presented to those who are really interested. So we're going to put... And we're going to put... With help... And well-being... Using angelic... energy okay and then well as always I always like to highlight and I'm just going to create that as a pink being attacked by flies <laughs> okay so we've done that we have just sent you a new email please click on the confirmation link to find out how to quickly lose belly fat okay so the idea of that is that um, I'm going to change this. So we have sent you a new that. email. Please click on the confirmation link to find. Now, angelic ebook can help you. Okay. And we're going to change that to pink as well. There. Grab that one there. Click on there. Like that. Okay. Well, actually, that looks a bit. What made that a bit darker? Just run the next one up. That looks better, doesn't it? It's a bit out of colour, actually. So we might just change that a bit. Let's move out of the way. That there, move that about there like that, and then we'll move this one over here. Good, ain't it? What you can do with this? Yeah, you like that? I think that looks good. Yeah, but that looks good. Okay, so we're going to save this one. I mean, do you, do you want to leave the leaves there because it's like nature, or do you want to like change the leaves? Um, the idea is, um, I've left that, yeah, because it's nature. Yeah, so I think that looks good like that. Okay, so we've done that. All right, so this is a, a page. And then what will happen then, you see, is when they confirm the email, then it's going to open up the next page, okay, which is this one here. So if we move to the next page, so we've done this one. If we go back here. If we go to the thank you page, and we edit this page here. And what we've basically done is we've created Mum's landing page, 
right? So congratulations, you are one step away from getting access to. Sorry, let's change this. And <coughs> Jellic Energy Healing. Okay. And we're just going to capital. And there's information at the bottom. You could like change that to like style. Yep, that's it. So we now, so you know, now have the opportunity to acquire first hand latest celebrities are using. We're well, not going to worry about that. Let's say first hand. So I'm going to put Chris's. Imagine if he accidentally left it with um, where it's about belly fat on one of the ones. Oh, I know. Yeah, <laughs> you'd be in trouble, wouldn't you? So Chris's angelic healing. <laughs> To help with <laughs> well being and life. There we go. I'll do for now. So, again, I can play around with that layer. And then, what you do then says you go through this basically and you just start to put it all in place etc now as we've been going on so long i'm actually going to call it a day now but it just gives you an idea of what you do so the idea then is you save this page okay and then we're going to try it out so we're going to click on here that's fine now if we go here and we click on here so home page we'll go to home page this is going to open up this page so a miraculous method with no invasive approach to helping your body and mind with crystals using angelic energy. So as a higher energy well-being ebook is here, right? So this is this is how we're going to capture it. So we're now going to click on this link. Please check required field. So what that means is I haven't set up the field to open this up. So we'll just go in here. Gonna double check this. But basically you get the idea. And the idea is that you always have a pending form because it looks good, and then you always have a welcome form as where the ebook's gonna be. Alright Sam? Yep. You got an idea now of how that's all done? So I use it as a template and I can have like the special effects and stuff like that afterwards. That's it. Yeah, it's because I'm filming that it won't allow me to open the link. That's the only reason why it's, it's just slowing the whole process down. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you've enjoyed that. So um, say hi, bye, Sam, because we're going to shoot off now. Yeah, bye. So if you enjoyed your affiliate marketing yeah. training, now, as I said to you before, this is only a very small um, yeah, part of it. Very small part of it, yeah. So that's the thank you page. Click there. And you see here that subscription confirm, which goes there, subscription pendings. We're just going to check this. That's page. So that's uh, home page. Home page, thank you page. Do you want pending? Select. So subscription pending goes there. Subscription confirm goes there. Let's click that. Save. So we're just going to check now and see if this works. And what it should do is we just have to go to website, see if it works this time. Put my name in there. Click yes, I would love this. And it's opened up the page. That's gone straight to here, which says, attention, please confirm your email before continuing. This offer is exclusive. So now what we do is I put it in my support email. So let's go here. We'll look for the email. Now, the nine times out of ten, it's going to go into the spam folder. Let's build a roll. Okay, so we're just going to refresh this. It might take a few minutes for it to come through, Sam. So it's not there yet, so let's go back to the inbox. There we go. Please confirm your subscription, so click on here. Now click here. 
So that confirms the subscription and then that's going to open up the thank you page. Which is this one here. So yeah. you see that? Yeah. So so you and that's exactly how it works. Now obviously I have to play around with this. This is going to be mum's picture which I'm going to sort out. <laughs> yeah, I know. But you get the idea. This would be where the yeah. ebook is. So basically you've got three pages that it opens up. So if we go back to the page, you'll see here after we've created it, that's your home page which collects your email. This one's your pending page which makes sure that they subscribe by uh, giving you approval to use their email. And then this one here is the thank you page, which allows them the ebook or some free gift that you have to give them, which really is the best way, the best approach. Because once we're on the email, then you can start to send out lots of other things to them on an email responder, which I'll talk to you about probably tomorrow if we get time. Yeah. All right, but we're doing a we're, we're doing a big job in uh, Dunstable surgery tomorrow. I'm going to be there for a couple of weeks, and Sam's helping me with that. So hopefully we'll we'll be able to do another video at some point and you can use this in your in your uh, work experience can't you yeah. sam so see guys so hopefully you've learned something as well as sam why i've been doing this okay uh all the very best cheers